What are you on? Welcome back to another video. So we're working on Gaz's tractor today. It's a Ferguson TD20. So yeah, we'll try and get it started and we'll do a bit of work to it. So the first thing that needs adjustment is the governor and our little screws down here. We just gotta undo this lock nut and turn this into whatever the specs are. Alright, I'll undo this nut here. We have undone all the governor gear on the other side too. Just unscrew it out with a flat edge screwdriver. Oh, she's nice and tight. <laughs> very, very tight. Far out. Oh, oh there we go. She's cracked. <laughs> Thread seem pretty through. Oh, there's our governor gear. A little adjustment screw. Yeah. Clean that up now. All right, we'll put it back in. It's all cleaned up. So, instructions are to tighten it in until white resistance is felt from the spring. Right there. I don't know. Should we? <laughs> yeah, give us a feel. Oh, you bloody watch your stuck. Yeah, I feel it. No, we should tighten it up there. Yeah. Tighten it this one. Yeah, I don't know. Is it pushing on that bloody government linkage? Yeah. <coughs> oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, so that's yeah. probably where we need to have it, right there. Just tighten it up there, yeah. Right. Well, we're just tightening it up now. Let me just loosen that first. Spill that resistance. Oh, yeah, that's it. We've now adjusted this clevis fork so that we can just slide our belt straight in like that. So we're all good. All right, so we've got this clevis fork in. We've got to tighten it in a bit. One full turn. on and tighten it back up. We're now adjusting the uh, portal stop. We'll undo these two half inch nuts. Just 
Slightly touching. There we go. That's where we want it seated. I'll just tighten that up. There we go. Hi, everyone. Uh, it's a bit late, but uh, we got the whole Ferguson fixed up. Baz ain't here yet, so um, he's cooking dinner. But uh, yeah, we got all the governor fixed up. Adjusted all this rod here. Um, also swapped the front tire out for him as well. Put the originals back on. Um, but yeah, we'll just see how she goes, I guess. Um, give her a start up and put some water in it. And then, uh, yeah. Well, seems to be idling good. I guess we solved the problem. I'll fill it up with some water now and put it away. <laughs> 